Well, we're standing here in one of the newest athletics facilities on the Liberty University campus, the new Liberty Softball Stadium, and it is set to open in March. And we're visiting now with the head coach, the Lady Flames, Dodd Richardson. And Coach Richardson, wow, what a place. This is my first time in here. This is abso Gorgeous, absolutely it? outstanding. What, what do you make of this? Uh, fantastic. This shows the commitment Liberty University has in their athletics. And for women's softball, we're really excited about it. You look around you, this is considered uh, – one of the best, if not the best in the nation. So we're very blessed. A thousand chair back seats. you got the video board out there in center field. You've got coaches offices, indoor hitting cages, all that good stuff. You're going to need those indoor hitting cages here in the early part of the year, aren't you? Oh, absolutely. And we look forward to using them. And we're excited with the upcoming season with the new recruits that we have. Well, you touched on it right there. Let's talk about recruiting. Uh, how big of an impact has this venue had? Well, um, it's been amazing. We have nine new recruits this year and 12 next year. We have an official coming this weekend for a potential 13. Uh, another one, uh, it's just been fantastic. 2016 class, we've got commitments uh, from four athletes there, and it's just like the cherry on top of the Sunday that's happening. We got our 2017 select, and we're excited about her, and the buzz is definitely about Liberty Softball, so we're excited to get out there in the national stage. Competed in a couple of different fall tournaments. Uh, did you get out of the fall season what you hoped to with the, with this bunch? Really did. Uh, unfortunately, we had some illnesses over the fall. So uh, when it came to playing time, however, everybody was in it to win it. In fact, we played three games on the stadium in the fall and we're 3-0. and You could see just a whole level of play just get to a whole nother level. Even the visiting teams that were here enjoyed it. Uh, but, you know, we were 5-2. and two. Uh, for the fall, but those two losses with, were with our loss of our shortstop. So we need to make sure that uh, we stay healthy this spring. Yeah, Mickey Loveridge will be a big addition to this uh, ball club when she's healthy. And then also you look at a couple of other returners and Megan Robinson and Kelby Allen. Kelby led the club in homers. Megan, I think, led the club in hitting last year. Absolutely. And it's really fun to see the kids that we were able to work with last year. These student athletes have matured so much. And during the senior year, you can see they're just ready to just live in the moment and that's what's so exciting when you see Kelby and Megan and Jamie uh, you know you just look at them and even Chandler she's not a senior because of red shirting so we got her another year but you can just see uh, this maturity level so they're gonna be leading this team in a great way a couple of more quick thoughts here as we touch on the schedule second straight year you're playing the defending national champions this time it's Florida <laughs> <Yeah>. uh, <laughs> you really didn't uh, you didn't shy away from tough competition here on this upcoming schedule not at all the beauty is having connections through the sport to be able to get the games that we want University of Florida we're gonna be down at my invitational which is right outside of Orlando and Claremont where we've got the University of Louisville Missouri Arkansas Cleveland State UMass Lowell University of Central Florida University of Tennessee at Chattanooga um, it's just there'll be 12 12 teams down there along with us and the University of Florida said hey why don't you stay come up and play us in our tournament so uh, it's going to be a beautiful trip a beautiful road we got some high top you know 20 teams top 30 teams then we've got some middle and then hopefully it'll we'll get some victories along the way and push ourselves to a higher level. And then, of course, March 19th, you got the home opener right here in this ballpark against Ryder. Certainly looking forward to that. Coach Richardson, we appreciate the time. Wish you Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays coming up. Merry Christmas, everybody. Just God bless you. All right, that's Dot Richardson, the head coach of the Liberty Lady Flames softball team. And my name is Nick Pierce for the Liberty Flames Sports Network.